All right, so this is what we call EBW. For those of you who are new, which we have a lot of new people lately, EBW stands for Everybody Wins. So unlike a mini that we run sometimes at night, late night, towards the end of the night, we run a mini to maybe fill out the final spot or two in a break. This way, everybody gets something. It's just a matter of which one you get. You can get these spots that are valued at $160, $170 for $59, but at least you're going to get a break in something, and that's the Donruss football break. Or you could also get a spot in a half a case triple teamer. So what we're going to do is this list over here does not random. I don't like to random that list because I need to keep it in order. It's easier for me and my brain to process who goes in what versus them being all jumbled up. All right. So the list doesn't randomize just your names. So we do the same thing. We'll random them just like we do other breaks. Get our number 13 times up in this mug. Did I send you a Cortland Sutton? Oh, yeah, I did give you the Cortland Sutton, didn't I? I found something else for you, too, Amy. So we'll match them up here. Thanks, everybody. EBW's work. I got a short week. I'm leaving town on Sunday. And I want to try to move everything as I can before we leave. One time to go yet. Match them up. You definitely want to be one and two in a blitz mix. So look at that. Johnny Z is in the blitz mix. And Joseph Billings is in the blitz mix. Congrats, Billings. Michael B is in the Spectra Half Case, the Valley of Cards. So these two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. These are my... Don Russ people, which we're going to do right now, so we don't forget to do it. And Michael B, dude, you got in both. You got two spots, three hundred dollars worth of spots for one hundred twenty bucks. <laughs> but he also bought a bunch of other EB dubs. Maybe that was the final two you bought. All right, so I'm going to print this. You will see these fillers appear now and again on the website. We don't do them all the time. I actually try to stay away from them. But when I, when I know there's higher priced products, sometimes it helps to do that. Hmm. 